Sorry about that curious and quirky end to the last video, everyone. I had a thing that happened, and I'm now continuing this recording about like 19, 20 hours into the future. I've adjusted the gamma settings up a bit. I'm also playing with my mouse sensitivity right now, as my new mouse actually has a setting for me to control that on here. A review of the objectives indicates that we've already gotten 700 in loot. Uh, I did say that I wasn't going to go for, I was pretty sure I wasn't going to go for a full loot clear. Again, I think there's like, I think I got over half of it. Uh, what I think I'm going to do now is to, uh, just go for the scepter and then leave. There's some other notes spread around here, but, uh, I'm no expert player of Thief, and I'm not going to concern myself with that. I'm just someone, just a man who's trying to play a game. Now, the only problem is I don't remember how to get the scepter. There's a pretty pool, by the way, everyone. Whee! Splish splash. <laughs> Go ahead and get out. For those of you who are concerned about the frame rate, like I said, it's gonna be a thing. It's the thing's not gonna change. What's through here? Uh, I have to remember my way around. Oh, good. I gotta find the way in the options that'll make that appear for me. Oh, shit. I'd rather not start this out with failure. Come along now. Actually... Where are you at, little buddy? There's actually multiple guys in here, I'm pretty... I think. There's probably, like, maybe eight, nine guards left conscious in the castle. Hmm. Hmm. The is I don't know exactly where they are. That walking could easily be just above me. Okay. Ah, yes. Okay. I don't need to I don't need to be going in there. Just got to remember my way around everyone. So, uh, that water arrow was wasted. That's fine. There's a reason why I stole that vase there at the beginning. The tutorial mission so that I'd have some extra gold to play with. Oh goodness. Is it just me or did something move? Just you. Oh well. That water arrow did horrible. <laughs> now that's a true waste. There we go. Wasted a damn water arrow. We'll have to make do. <coughs> Don't mind me, guy. Did you hear an <laughs> Oh shit. Oh my god! They killed him! I didn't kill him. Fuck. When fuck. I find you, you'll regret it. Fuck, 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 fuck.
That was horrible. Shit. I was hoping to knock him out without alerting the other guy. Damn it. He stopped walking. Where is he going? Hmm. Where is he? Okay. You can't dodge an arrow. Fuck. That could have gone better. But you know, it could have gone worse. Garrett's not flawless. At least not in my playthrough. How do I make this sort of gold thing, like, constantly appear? Maybe in the options somewhere? I just don't know where. Also, yeah, I just lit the gamma up a bit. That should be more discernible. Certainly easier for me to see. Although the morning light of the sun is coming through right now in my eyes. So there's always that. <gasps> Any shinies? Definitely shinies. I said I was going to stop picking those up. But here we are, all the same. I'm picking up shinies. Okay, I'm not going to bother with that. Yet. Okay. Let's see if I can get you. Alright. That's one. Who goes there? Gotcha. Let's be patient and sneaky and quick save. And all the things I really can be. Also, frame rate. Come back to Grimith. Come back. Your country needs you. I need you. Otherwise, things are going to be all helter skelter. Okay. Hopefully, I can do this better this time. You don't see me. Not see me. Mess with me and your crow meat, boy. Fuck! That was the antithesis of not see me. him with my loud running. Damn it. Gotta stop sucking. This is for posterity, everyone. There we go. Sneaky. Now, I... Caught on the torch. Ideally, what you do is, you know, take out one of these guys on one side, use a water arrow to knock out that torch. What happened in practice was not quite what I wanted. All the same, we did it. Low E fucking Seamos. I was caught on the body again. That's outside. Okay, light. That's the best I can do with the blinds. That's a little better. Tilt my screen. 
And here we are in a guard barracks. See if there are any prizes. Nope. No prizes. No prizes. Prizes! Good, 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 good. Alright, that was enough fun in the guard barracks. Uh, what the hell's up here? Bupkis. Well, it's time for us to just run around and play now. I've already been down here. I'm not gonna worry about it. We still have some more guards to deal with, but for now, things are okay. Going through here. Who reads them, or if it's just for show. Takes us into a library with this. I thought I was gonna read that. No. My lordy Bafford, Spakesy sailed to Jenny, did you be? Dragbun, the hammer hearts have been afoot. A skulk, a ferretin about, grabbing many a one to vanish in the codestone down below the forgy chain cells. Tooks they a deal of Tarkis and their clutches nights pass, and two patrons as well, named of Lizel and Ryan, scuffed up as they left. And they's not the first Christ, Jenny. Ill wonder then if Dragbun grows sparse come these days. Course, lack of blame to one hand, but I gave Jenny a firm understanding. Blood and doom in the whole book, so you'll be learning him on all he can about how to turn the hammers off him, never you fear. About your Victoria, nothing yet. Walks she an inch above the ground for all the dirt of her footprints I have I found. Dominic. I like to think my voice acting there was just as good as the voice acting of others in this game. Also, more prizes. Book. Lord Bafford. Recent delivery of antiquities from Bond contains several items which we felt might be of interest to you. Descriptions follow, but you are welcome to drop by our shop to examine them or our other goods in person. An ornamental scepter three feet in length. The body of the stave is weirwood, carved in star and dot pattern. Six inches of the ferrule and five inches of the grip are bound with burnished copper overlaid by an ink and glaze. Oof. Cr crack dare? Varnish, you got me on that one, folks. The crowning feature of this magnificent piece, however, is the six-inch teardrop-cut cloudstone, one of the finest of its type we have seen. A treasure box of two feet by three feet of silver birch wood. The lid is of inlaid pearl line and onyx and a maze pattern carved into the wood. The feet are lion paws, each clutching a crystal globe. The inside of the box contains two principal compartments, one with glass shells and one without. Beneath the compartments is a lockable two-inch false bottom for your most valuable treasures. Grimworth and de Perrin, fine antiquities and precious relics. All right, that's good information. And I think that's everything of value in here. Green bottles are worthless. That's also worthless. Now gold bottles, and there's a few around here. Oh shit. That is not enough darkness. Okay. Oh. 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 Oh yeah, you. I'd like to pretend I remember you. Something there. I am, uh... Even when I'm crouched, I still have the running thing going. Apparently I need to make sure I reset the walk setting. That was terrible. Okay. Well, that was fun, everyone. How about we do that again? Perhaps even minimize my travel distance. Hopefully he won't spot me. I think I'm just in darkness. <coughs> Close. I suppose we'll find hey, out, though. What was that? 
Who's creeping around there? Ah! Ah! Damn it. Ah! Oh shit, I saved them? <laughs> this is why I hate quick saves. This is why I hate quick saves. This is why I never use quick saves <laughs> in any of my series. I pressed F11 instead of F12. Yeah. Well, we'll have to redeem this, folks. That's it. You had it. Nope. No, I have it. No, I have it. I haven't had it. Oh, hell. Help! I don't want to have to kill you. Don't make me kill you. Good! Sheath the sword! Run away! <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll have to use a, f a flash bomb. <laughs> Son of a bitch, Griffin. All right, I got one more flash bomb. I was really hoping to be fancy with those, but I only have one left. Oh, man. Well, since I have this food, just eat it. Oh, man. All right. I need all the gold in retrospect. I think I'm safe out here. Takes me back to here. This is the front area, I'm pretty sure. That should be fine. See, yeah, there's the front door. That's heavily guarded. You don't want to deal with that. The staircase takes us up to the second floor. There. Oh my god. That was terrible. Fucking A, Grimoth. Fucking A. Any prizes I leave? I might very well have. It's hard to see in the dark. Okay! That was a good bit of recovery, right? <laughs> Well, now that we walked out here, we can admire the view. I'm one up there. All I need to do is get up there. Oh, man. <laughs> I can't fucking believe this. Pretty. Okay. Now, if memory serves, it should be around here. Here we go. I think you're it. Nope. Wrong one. You can cut apart the tapestries. They can lead you to secret passages. I was looking for one in particular. The tapestries will clearly look different. And that was a mistake I made there. No. Maybe you're the one. I don't think so, though. Oh, there we go. See? I jinxed myself into being successful. Oh my goodness, that was a terrible quick save I made there. For fuck's sakes. Although I imagine it was great on the comedy front. This room. This room was where I wanted the flash bombs to be fancy. Figured I was gonna need both of them. This room has a guard. 
with a gong. And he will ring that gong, causing all sorts of fun shenanigans to happen. First thing we're gonna do is take care of the light in this room. All the while this guard is none the wiser. I don't know why. He's so dumb. He just is. It's irrelevant. Let's go ahead and take care of this. I have four more water arrows left. Basically, the four I purchased before the start of this mission. Okay. Now that it's pitch fucking dark, see if you can do this, Grimoth. It's gonna require hitting this damn thing, though. And being fancy. You only have one flash bomb now instead of two. Uh, I might not want to be fancy. I'll try, just for demonstration effect. There we go. Now him ringing that summons other friends. One little noise. Unless I've... It was supposed to summon other friends. Ha! Huh. I guess they didn't hear the gong. Well, that's interesting. And completely unexpected. <sighs> Fuck. At least it's totally dark. We'll find you soon enough! Grimace sad. You didn't even summon all the guys you were supposed to so that I could flash bomb them all. What the fuck, man? Damn it, AI. It does not do the fancy things I want it to do. Don't mind me. Hello? Show yourself. No. Nothing here now. Nope. Nothing but us chickens. Come on up. Nope. Hello? Anyone there? Do I want to save in this location? Yes, not. I think I'm crazy enough. Who to save is there? Save in this is location. someone there? You're in for it now! Damn it! <coughs> Alright, let's try this again. There's an intruder here! Totally an intruder. He's gonna go ring it himself. There we go. Back here, you coward! Suppose I knocked out one of the guys. You can't hide for long. I should have looked away from that. Should have definitely looked away from that. But all the same. <laughs> it's a throne room. How yep. pretentious can you get? With our scepter. Here we go. <sighs> Oh man, that was great fun, everyone. All right.
right, the key. Nope. Uh, another key? All oh, right, it's another key that I picked up. No? What do you guys has a key? Did I not pick it up? No, I didn't pick it up because I'm dumb. Here we go. Unlock this too. Where am I? No, I don't need that. Go away. Here we go. We have stacks of loot. Whole stacks of loot. That's a candlestick. More artwork. The same variant and variety. We have a scepter. Yes, you'll recall this room. That's where the library would have taken us. You know, I hadn't fucked up. Oh, yes, this way. I suppose I'll show it off. Don't think I'll be needing this anymore. Da 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 da. Now, it's not quite a secret passage, but you can all clearly tell that Lord Bofford really cares about this, so he keeps it sheltered as much as he possibly can. Short of, you know, sticking a tapestry in front of it. You recall this room? Maybe. Here we have a ledger. Which you can pause to read, should you so wish. What the hell is going on with Drekbon? Even if Ginny's grafting, he damn well ought to be more subtle than this. If it's not turned around in another week, toss it up to Ramirez as breach. Okay. I'll keep that in mind, boss. 1229, we are missing 200 gold. Which I think are those two gold bottles? Well, my memory might not be flawless about this mission, but I'll be damned if uh, I can't recall a few things. No, well, out of that little semi-secret area we go. I think it's semi-secret anyway, if only because it's such a pain in the ass to get to. Of course, that's a personal opinion on the subject. Here we have interesting artwork. More interesting artwork. But not quite what we're looking for. That takes us back here. I think those wine bottles are somewhere in this area. I'm pretty sure I didn't pick those up in the last video. Ah, here we go. No, I'm still missing a hundred. Damn it. Damn. Beyond that, I don't know. That 100 GP can be anywhere. I also have to remember my secret fanciful leather for exit. Hmm. If I was a stack of 100, really, I could be anywhere in this mission. Here's a beautiful little swimming environment for all of your needs. That takes us to the throne room. Here. Someone's gonna tell me in the damn comments. I don't understand why I care. I'm not gonna be able to replicate these this feat in future missions. <laughs> gotcha! Watch 1429 is not the maximum. Yes! Now I just have to remember where that's where that sneaky cool exit with the lever is. Eh. Should be on the first floor. Oh man. That was beautiful. Fucking found it and everything. 
Now, if I were an exit, where would I have placed myself? It's a secret sort of... Well, I guess it's really not secret. It's a lever that has itself pla placed by one of the torches, and it's not the front exit, that's for sure. I mean, I guess I could go by the basement. I don't want to do that, go. I'll have to pass by that guy again. We'll have to have a talk. Is it on this side, maybe? I mean, I guess I could always pause if I really cared enough to try to find it. It's not really important. I can just leave by the basement. Probably not the front door, though. Oh, no, here we go. Sweet. Fucking found it. Get me out of here, Mr. Wizard. And I'm on the city streets now. Free and clear. Mission complete. Sneaking to Lord Bafford's manor, ideally by blindjacking or pickpocketing the wellhouse guard for his key and case the place. Steal the jeweled scepter with as little notice as possible. Grab 700 in loot while you're in the manor. Don't kill anyone and then return to the city streets with as little notice as possible. That did not happen. 50 minutes and 16 seconds. Maximum loot. Uh, I did pick a pocket. I knocked out 17 guys. Uh, 50 damage was dealt. Uh, I dealt to enemies. Essentially the uh, the spiders. And I took nine. Some from the spiders, some from that guard. And I healed up four damage. I killed the four spiders. And uh, three bodies were discovered by enemies. Would have liked for that to have been zero, but maximum loot, bitches. I'm I'm gonna have to gonna have to take that. Alright everyone. Hope you enjoyed Lord Baffer's manor and uh my my gifted play. Oh, God. Hope the gamma was better. The frame rate was definitely better. I'll see you all next time.